All right, wake up, little Susie's. Holy shit, I'm stuck. Not good. Not good, not good. Oh, not good at all. Run! Oh, mother. Welcome back, everybody, to Ravenhurst. I am an old guy gaming, and I have some awesome news. I finally finished laying all my irrigation pipe. Oh, my goodness, it took a lot of iron to do this. Um, I don't, I don't know how much iron I made, but I made a lot because <laughs> each one of these pipes takes 50 iron ingots and I think like five, uh, short iron pipes to make. And yeah, it took a while, but we are finally done and we have full irrigation all the way to the pipe cap. And, uh, now what remains is for me just to decide which of my crops I want to expand beyond, you know, the 20 plants. Uh, carrots, <clears throat> excuse me, carrots is definitely going to be one of those for sure. Uh, cause that's the thing that I seem to run out of. I might expand the wheat some more too, because you need wheat to make steel polish, believe it or not. You have to, you need to make steel polish from the flour from the wheat. Um, so I don't know. I'll have to think about that. We'll just kind of see how things go, but, uh, definitely going to expand the carrots for sure. So, that, so that, that's a really good feeling, you know, to get that accomplished. Uh, one of the things I'd like to do in this episode, our main goal is to hit the um, uh, the lodge. Um, but one of the things I would like to do is is see if we can find some more chickens um, and get our chicken coop going. And apparently, you know, I can make uh, other animal pins too. So um, <clears throat> if we type in a rabbit, can we do... A, okay, so we can do a rabbit cage trap. And we have to get a male and female rabbit for that. And then rabbit feed should be pretty easy to make too. And then we know we can do the chicken coop. I thought um, I thought I read something about like a stag or a deer or a buck. Uh, deer? Hmm. Maybe not. Maybe we can't do that. What about uh, for pigs? Or hogs. Or boars. Nope. Okay, so I guess it's just chickens and rabbits. I, th I, I could have sworn I read in the Ravenhurst that we could also do this with um, with deer, too. Do we try doe? Huh. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, unless it's named something different. But anyway, <clears throat> I mean, you know, even just having rabbits and chickens uh, would be nice to, to have. Especially the chickens, because then we can, you know, get the eggs and stuff, too. So, all right, let's see, where are we at here? Um, I'm going to uh, keep having you guys make iron to kind of replenish everything that we've used. And do I have more iron? I don't. I've already used it all up again. I suppose we could start working on smelting some copper and zinc um, and lead and stuff like that in these guys, too. We could maybe just do... Uh, we could do brass, um, well, no. All right, yeah, let's do that. Let's, let's start smelting copper and zinc. So we'll grab some zincs and some coppers, um, and then we can use that stuff, of course, if you didn't already know, uh, to make brass. Perfect, okay. And I have a bunch of lead, you know, to smelt up too, of course, so let's just top up that clay. What are you doing? You're working on carbon and more clay, and uh, and uh, we need iron though to for steel. Okay, so that's um, all he's working on at the moment. And same thing here. We're just you know feeding carbon into to this forge here. Let's grab this out of here. I used uh, pretty much all of my steel upgrading the horde base. Uh, but that's <clears throat> that's enough steel for us, you know, to do re repairs during the Horde Night, so I'm not too worried about it at this point. And, yeah, I just going to have to go do some more mining. So for now, let's just keep feeding the carbon, I guess, into these guys. And I'm going to move that clay down to there. And then we'll do the same thing over here. Okay, that takes care of that. All right, so those guys are doing stuff. Let's put this back in here for now. 
and uh, I need to put some other parts and things back. So let me get that done first, and then we'll then we'll head out. Okay, let's take off and head towards our quest location. And I'm gonna be keeping my eyes peeled for chickens and rabbits along the way, and see if we can get. Let's see, we need a female chicken and both a male and female rabbit. And I guess we just shoot them, right? And then we have a chance of harvesting one. I don't remember where I originally got those chickens uh, that I have from, but I'm assuming that's probably what happened. Unless it was in a bird's nest, maybe? I don't know. I'm not sure how that works, but we'll figure it out. Okay, so this is the same... Uh, no, actually, this isn't the same lodge that we did. Or is it? Now the doors are open. I think it is. Uh, it's just repopped. So we're going to put our uh, bedroll down the street a little ways. In case we bite the dust. This is uh, this is a tough POI. Um, be, and it's because it's... You know, there's just a lot of open area in it. And not a lot of places where we can... You know, uh, have a choke point for the zombs. So... Uh, but, you know, the last time we did it, um, actually, I, I was killed the last time I did it. I got nailed by a cop. So, let's hope we can get her done this time without any kind of deaths on our part. Lots of deaths on the zombies' part, but not on our part. Okay. Uh, so, this is a clear and retrieve. And here we go. All the weeds came back. You know there's going to be a dog over here, though, somewhere. Well, maybe. Chance of a sp dog spawn. I'm not seeing him, though. Maybe he didn't spawn this time. Or he's just real well hidden, and he's going to jump out and bite us in the ass when we least expect it. Wow, we got a glower already? Okay. So it's just him. Let's fight him out here so we don't wake everybody else up. I do have a rad remover on my katana. So he's not going to be healing now. 1110 hit points on this bastard. Alright, he did. Well, we riled up a bunch of Zeeks. They're all in that room over there. And we got a couple outside guys coming after us, too. Okay, let's go this way. Just have them come right on down the fence line here. Go away, dog. Go away, football player. Go away, little girl. Go away, soldier. I told you to go away. You too. Man. That guy just won't stay down. Is he down now? Okay, I think we're good. You know, I'm, I'm thinking that there there aren't any fetch-only quests in Tier 4. I've never seen one in Ravenhurst. So, that's kind of what I'm thinking here. Alright, let's go in through here. Got another football player right in there. And somebody banging on the wall in here. Or banging on the counter. Oh, got another dog. Let's fight him out here. Come on, pooch. Hey, we got a skill point. Nice. All right. Let's uh, crouch down here for a second. Uh, we're working on perception 
and so penetrator lucky looter those are the two i've working on specifically and so we need more perception itself all right so for the next what's that require that requires level six but we should be able to get the next level of lucky looter on our next level cool okay back into the fray here there was a Big, yeah, I was going to say, where'd she go? Shoot you in the coochie, big mama. All right, she did. Is this lootable? I don't think it is. Let's just get it out of the way. We'll get plastic from it anyway. Not a lot. Whoop, Ravenhurst freeze. There we go. Check in here and see if there's something good to eat. <laughs> Not that. Not that. Okay. You know, I still have yet to find a broken stove that I can try that little kit thing out on. I've not done that yet. Okay, so we got a soldier Zeke in there. Let's stand back here and pop him with this. That did a pretty decent amount of damage to him. Somebody just walked up the the thing there. Alright, he should bleed out. There's a spider outside. How is that missing? What? What? What the hell, man? How did that miss? Oh, hacks. I didn't miss that time. <laughs> I was going to say, man, what the hell? Okay. All right, let's just do the same thing as before. Get everybody lined up, and we'll take them out as they come along. Lord, that I can I don't know how long that took. <laughs> it took too long. Holy crap. Okay, let's put these on for a second. Check this out. Uh, okay, that's pretty nice. Um, was there another bag that dropped back here, or am I just imagining things? Let's just look really quick. I don't. Nah, I guess I'm just imagining things. Let's just go all the way around just to make sure. Okay, pack in the house. I think we've cleared the first floor. Maybe. Maybe. 
Uh, let's put these back on and check these bookcases really quick. Okay, that takes care of the books. We got a couple of nice uh, upgrades there. Check these guys. Okay, I guess that's it for in here. Uh, I'm not really too worried about the suitcases right now. Let's uh. Let's just look. I guess we'll look in here. <laughs> Since it's here, right? Um, nope. And not taking that stuff either. All right, here we go. Next floor. The fun begins again. Make sure everybody's loaded here. Look at all those red dots. Oh my goodness. Wow. Okay. Well, you know what? We're going to get two if we use this. And then we're going to just wake the rest of them up and we'll just play Ring Around the Rosie with this group again. Oop. Go this way. All right. Come get me. Let's block this for a second. He's the only one that came down? Hmm. Oh, they're all up there. Okay. That works. And it looks like they're trying to break out a... Oh shit. Not him. Oh shit, is that that big... That's that big monster phoenix diamond... What, whatchamacallit bird. Damn it, I'd rather not fight him out in the open, you know? All right, we got a running greenie here. Oh, shit. There, we need to knife her so she can't heal. She's not too terribly hard to kill, even as an irradiated. We just don't want her healing. Okay, I see a green... Some kind of green guy over there. I'm not sure who that is. There's a pumpkin head. Okay. Down with you. Grab this real quick. That guy's coming around the corner, right? Oh shit. Did we kill him? Yep, and he dropped the bag too. We need to get these back on. <laughs> At some point, I'll probably max out Fortitude just so I don't have to keep wearing those stupid glasses. All right, that buzzard concerns me a little bit. I'm not going to lie. Um, call 
couple shots off on him anyway. Whoops. Did we get him? We got him. Man, have I told you guys how much I love explosions in this game? Explosives, rather. Well, explosions and explosives. Whew, okay. Let's drop that, that. We'll keep the rest of this stuff for now. I'm going to actually keep these with me. So we've probably cleared the second floor now. I'm assuming... Here's a safe. Tell you what, we'll hit the safe uh, at the end. Okay, this room's clear. We'll grab this real quick. Okay. These aren't actual closets like the ones the zombies can pop out of. They're just blocks that look like shutters. Got a couple more bookshelves here. I don't even know if Lucky Goggles matter for bookshelves or not. I guess they probably would. Uh, auto turret schematic, okay. We'll learn that. Nothing in there. Um, let's just learn it. Why not? Who knows? Maybe we'll play rare with them sometime, but I've just, I've never been in, impressed with the stun batons in seven days. Even, you know, with them maxed out and everything. Okay, I'm not worried about the basic loot and dressers and stuff like that. Oh, you know what, though? There is a secret stash right here. It's just painted to look like a mirror. We already know that, so we'll scrap it. Man, they tore the shit out of this place, didn't they? Oh, that's the bird. Uh, did he spawn in here? How did he get in here? Huh, I don't know. 70 feathers off that dude. Okay. Two out of three floors done. Let's hit floor number three. Shit, I didn't even make any noise. All right, here we go again. Are you guys going to come down the stairs or are you going to come out the windows? What are you going to do? I'm not entirely sure what they're doing. Okay. Let's, uh, they're all trying to break through doors and stuff at the moment, so let's just let them come to us. I'm not going to go in there and try and charge them, because that wouldn't be a smart thing to do at this point. We'll just let them come to us. If we're lucky, you know, we'll only get a couple, three at a time, and then we can deal with them, of course. <laughs> Wake up, little Susie's. Holy shit, I'm stuck. Not good. Not good, not good. Oh, not good at all. Run! Oh, mother. <laughs> good. Oh, no, no. This way, this way. Oh. Okay, that was not good. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, my God. 
One more active seeker. Whew. Okay, we have to take care of our infection too here. Yeah, this this POI is dangerous as all get out, man. Probably the most dangerous tier four that we've done so far. Um High school was pretty dangerous too, because again, lots of open areas, but yeah. Okay, let's take this. This is just a sprain, so we don't need there's nothing else we can do about that right at the moment. And we'll put some of this stuff back in here. Keep all the ammo ammo with us. Okay, we're good. We just have to wait for those criticals to go away, but uh, we still have one more red dot. Oh, it's a crawler. Okay. There you go, bud. I'll put you out of your misery. Okay. Whew. As crazy as that was... And, oh my goodness, that was crazy. Look at, <laughs> look at the destruction up here. <laughs> Gosh. We're not done yet, though, man. We are not done yet. We have to do the final attic and that place is nasty all right here a couple bookshelves let's put this back on it's another honey This is kind of like a mini loot room in here. And we also have some more bookcases. So let's check this. We'll do the mini loot room before we go upstairs. Electric weapons. I think there might be another hidden stash crate right there. Look at that. Okay, we'll take that. And the satchel is right under here. Okay, we got that done. This is crazy, man. <laughs> this is so crazy in here. All right, yeah, another bookshelf. Hungry. Okay, let's deal with that. Okay, let's do this little loot room here. Gun store box. Give us something good. That's pretty good stuff. Recog. That must have been a cop explosion that blew up up here. I'm glad it wasn't closer to this room or we would have lost a lot of this loot. Don't want the crossbow bolts because if and when we decide to use crossbows again, we're going to be using steel bolts anyways. Uh, all right. Always happy to get steel polish. There's a few more blocks on the horde base I want to upgrade to steel polish too. Look at that. Okay, we have three crowbars now, you guys. That's a beautiful thing. I'm not using them for normal salvage, though, um, just because, uh, oh, that's very nice, too. You know, they're kind of precious at this point. At some point, though, we'll probably, I'm guessing, large storage. Oh, that's cool. I guess we learned that a long time ago. Um, I'm guessing we'll probably start coming across them more frequently until I do. Oh, that was a good find. Okay, I needed that. Um... Until we come across enough to where I, I start to have an abundance of them. I think I'm going to just scrap these for the resources. Yeah, we've already found some good stuff and we haven't even hit the end loot yet. Did we check this one? Yeah, working stiff. Okay. Boy, oh boy, this is going to be fun. Now... Uh, if you guys didn't watch the live stream where I did this, 
there's a cop right behind that door and he killed me. Um, and there was a, there was a bear in there. I don't know if he still is or not. Yeah, I think I do see a bear. So, just trying to think how I want to, how I want to play this here. Okay, there's a mummy right there. Okay, well, let's, um, blow the door. Oh, shit! The dog's right there! <laughs> run! Run! Okay. Irradiated bikers are insanely tough, man. Uh, just unbelievably tough, as you just saw there. Oh, now we got... People from the outside joining the fun. Yay! Hey, cut it out! Oh no, we lost our M60. Son of a bitch. Oh crap! <laughs> Not good. Oh, that sucks, you guys. I, I was afraid that was going to happen too. Oh, we get a screamer. Nice. Come here. Don't scream. Don't scream. Don't scream. Thank you. Oh, shit. <laughs> nah, nah. This was a great time for a lockup to occur. Oh, my God. We don't have our M60 anymore. This is not good. This is like the definition of not good. The freaking game would quit locking up on me. I need to try and get away from these outside guys. Here, let's do this. Yeah! Ow! We have to stay really close to the building so we don't fail the quest. Alright, who's in front here? Oh, shit! <laughs> right away! Get out of here. Woohoo. How come they're not attacking me? Not that I want them to, mind you, but... Okay, let's see if we can get all of the nasties over onto this side by the bear and get de-aggroed. I'm going to sit here for just a second. Okay, he's dead. Aw, oh, shit. Do we have two bears? check it now. Do we have the... We don't have these on. Of course we don't. Oh, sh... Yeah. Um... At least the bear's fighting the zombs. That's good for us. I need a place where I can just have a few seconds to... to just chill for a minute. Alright. Uh, we have this in here, so let's take that. See, we're going to have to be careful of this shotgun or we're going to lose it, too. Alright. Let's, um... 
Oh, that didn't work so well. Okay, we killed him. Killed him. Are you dead too? Okay. We can get the Zoms killed. It's really the bears that I'm super concerned about. And you too, of course. I gotta, we gotta get a health pack going, but man, I just don't have time to stop and do it. Holy mother of God. Okay. Oh, you're scary. Oh, wow. He just like did an exorcist stand back up thing. Off with your head, you son of a... Oh my god, okay. We're still alive. <laughs> I don't know why. I don't know how we're still alive. We're still alive. Good lord. Alright, so we need to get back up to the top. Uh, with the bears in the neighborhood, I'm not so sure. Let's just peek around the corner here. Yeah, that side's clear. Let's get on this. Okay, I'm going to park the bike right here. Oh, man, I'm so pissed that we lost our our M60 um, and all of the mods that were on it. Okay, we've got a bear up here. Is he the last? No, I think we're going to have guys in the back room, too. Look at the the destruction up here oh this is terrible uh all right well here let's do this get this ready okay well that killed the bear but we still haven't finished the quest i don't see any more red dots on the compass but uh, they're going to be in those back rooms there and maybe behind that counter. Okay. Let's close this door. Not that that's going to buy us much time. Oh, we made ourselves a little hole in the the floor. I just want to make sure nothing's coming from at us from that side. Alright, we're not done. We are not done yet. So there's going to be dudes in there and back there and maybe in there. So the question is... Oh, there's a cop that just spawned in. I hate that. I mean, we know how to deal with him. I'll tell you what, man, this is harder this time around than it was when I did it on the stream. I don't think there's any special loot in those two rooms. They're like, I think they're just bathrooms. All right, I'm going to put this down here. Where's my pick? So we got a cop and a fat guy. He's feral. Uh, 
I don't think my pipe bomb will destroy anything in there, but I don't know. We probably better play it safe. We still haven't cleared the area. Oh, there's another cop right there. Shoot him in his big fat belly. Still haven't cleared it because there's more guys over there. But I'll tell you what we're going to do now. Um, we're going to put these on. And we're going to get the good stuff now. So that way we got it. And um, then we'll worry about uh, finishing off the rest of these dudes. What a fight, man. Holy crap. <laughs> that, was, that got really hairy there for a while. Okay. We've got ourselves a really nice desert vulture, guys. I love it. Telescopic dawn, some nice steel leg armor. Okay. That, uh, we earned it, man. We freaking earned it. Absolutely earned it. Let's get rid of a couple things we don't need to be carrying around right now. Okay. Take all that stuff. Come here. Give me your head. That's not the... Oh! It is! Um... I don't think I can safely use explosions on him. Alright. Let's shoot him with the armor-piercing 7.62s. Return to Trader. We did it! <laughs> oh my god! You guys, was that insane or what? Was that insane or what? Oh my goodness. I can't believe we survived all that. Can't believe we survived all that. All right, Rex, what you got for us? Think you're pretty smart now. Um, uh, this is 1680. Side. Yeah, this is definitely worth the most money, so I think we'll take that. All right, so that how many tier fours have we done? Um, let's take a look. So we have done one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, eight. So we need to do two more two uh, tier fours, and then uh, we should be able to graduate to tier five. Now, once that happens, I'm not necessarily going to start doing tier fives immediately. Uh, I'd like to actually go back and maybe do a few tier threes um, because there's a lot of POI tier three POIs that you know we haven't done. Um, I wonder though if I do that now if the tier threes would still be available. Maybe we should start working on some tier threes now. Um, and then, you know, finish the tier fours later. Because I just did the asylum. You know, I don't want to do that three times in a row. At least not on camera, anyway. We've already done the colony ship once. That takes a million years to get through. So if I'm going to farm out the rest of the tier fours, I should do easier ones like the church. Because the church is probably, or the waterworks between those two... Uh, and Waterworks even is probably actually the easiest one. Okay, so he doesn't have either one of those. So I think what we're going to do is let's go back and just do some tier three stuff. Um, so what's this? Split level house by Crater Creator. It's a fetch quest. All right, we'll do that. All right, guys, but that is it for um, today's episode. So what I'm going to do is go back to the base. I need to I need to do some mining. I need to get some gasoline going. I have some, but I don't have a lot. And um, so what I'm probably going to do is just do uh, chore types of things for uh, during the day on 126 here. And then, of course, the hordes tonight. So we'll start the next episode with Horde Night 26 at the base. 
and then we'll go do this tier three um, after we do the Horde Knight. So that is the tentative plan at this point. And yeah, so I will, I'll probably farm, un unless I can find a new tier four that we haven't done yet, I'll probably go ahead and farm out the, um, the la the remaining tier fours, um, like at the church, if I can find a couple more church, because it's, or, or not the church, I'm sorry, the waterworks, because that's just the easiest one to do, you know? Okay, let's let the spikes deal with them because my shotgun is almost broken. All right, guys, that is it. Thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment and share out the video. And we'll catch you in the next episode. Goodbye.